Oh. <sighs> I feel like I owe you a lot. <laughs> There's a lot of explanation I have to do, but I'm not gonna get too much into details. I'm just gonna give you the bigger picture, a bigger picture of what has been happening in my life for the past five months. So welcome back to my channel guys. I am back finally. It's 2024. Happy New Year. I know. I know it's March. Um, but I'm here. So I've been missing for five months, which really went by really, really fast. It just feels like it's been like maybe five weeks, but it's been five months. Anyway, so what has happened in my life? What was she? What did she do? First of all, you can notice that there is a different setting. <laughs> um, because I moved. So last time we talked, actually since I started my um, YouTube channel, I, I had been living um, out of the center city um, just because it was better, I, I guess. Um, I owned a place out of the center of the city it was just more affordable what um, I was looking for at the time so that's why I was there but now I'm back in the city the decision came because I just needed this change was needed I really 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 wanted this I really needed this and I'm so happy I found my dream place I mean the city is not the New York or whatever but I I literally I manifested this place because I spent so much time on um, TikTok and uh, what was it, Instagram, of uh, in YouTube also, but really more TikTok and Instagram of people like touring the new beautiful places in New York with a view and whatever. I was like, yeah, well, I'm not in New York, but oh my God, I would like to live in a place like this. And I, I kid you not. I don't think I'm even in like in Austria. Like it really, I I manifest like I'm, maybe one day I'm gonna show you. For sure I'm gonna show you the view. That's for sure. I'm not really keen to like make a home tour, but maybe I will change my mind because I, I usually say that I used to say that also for the last place I was in, and I never showed it. So yeah, I don't know if I I really want to do that, but I feel like I might just because I'm so in love with this place. So, and I will probably do that when I have everything done because I'm still, I'm, like, I, I just moved in, like, I have the place since over five months now, but I've officially moved since a month now, let's say. So, yeah, it's, a, you know, and then in Austria, you find places that are completely empty most of the time. I mean, for me, at least, those are the best places. It's just... And they're always on the market because people are not really willing to buy a whole kitchen by yourself, like, you know, whatever. But I will probably insert some picture. One day I will talk about the place and just insert a picture of how I found it in case I actually show you the place, how I found it and how I had to furnish it. So here I got the to like the actual toilet was it was in um, the bathtub alone sink in the bathroom. That was it that was literally it every single other thing i had to purchase myself and that's what kept me also busy for all this time because i'm very particular with what i like and then i have to research and be sure that i i'm really gonna like it and and so on so yeah i moved that's the number one thing secondly i really focus on my health as well and i think i've already mentioned before like i have kidney failure then um i had uh, i have um uh, unbalanced or hormonal, hormonal imbalance. I just have words in German right now because that's how I every time I have to get to explain it or is explained to me. So I'm sorry, but hormonal imba imbalance. Um, then now I'm going through massive hair loss. I know you can't tell because this week we're saving my life lately. <laughs> But we will get into that too because I'm really trying to transition to wearing my natural hair more but I, like i still do it's just really every time i film i happen to wear a wig but it's not like it's not every day it's not every day 
but when I say wearing more my hair, my natural hair, I mean like no, like no extensions, no, like everything artificial in my hair, I really want to like have my own hair. I would love to rock an afro or so, but my hair, it's weirdly changing lately. I don't know, like the texture of it, it's very, very dry, but like from the root, so it's just not an option, but I'm trying to find ways to make that happen. Number three, which is the big one for me, is that I quit it, my 9 to 5 job um, with no second plan. <laughs> I completely quit it because I don't know what came up me, uh, I don't know, but I really want to give a try to what I always dreamed of being in my life and doing for a living um, I have to say I haven't fully really started it and honestly I don't know if I should like say now what it, what what I'm doing um, mostly for bad luck I feel like I don't know maybe I'm, I'm super, um, superstitious is that how you say it I forgot anyway you know what I'm, I'm saying I, I mean and I've noticed that every time I want to do something or I plan on doing something or I start doing something and I I say it loud to people before it's actually totally happened, most of the time, if not every single time, it just doesn't happen. So I'm kind of scared of saying it, but again, that's another thing you're going to have to wait a little bit. I'm really like, and also saying it here, I feel like... Um, keeps me accountable for it so yeah I mean I am not having that job anymore nine to five I am living off of whatever I had on the side and uh, what I, I have by right so yeah that's the new thing so you would think oh she's gonna be vlogging more I don't know I can't promise anything I really stopped making you promises because at this point I feel like it's just getting ridiculous so I'll be here when I'm here and when I'm not here and I'm not here. That's that's just how how it's gonna roll. So yeah, that's the third thing that happened that also took me a very long time to decide and I I kinda I kinda was scared and I kinda am still scared because yeah, it's not something you really are encouraged to do in the society. I mean in any any place in the world it doesn't really matter where you are, but it's just it's even harder as a foreigner. Yeah, to be like, yeah, it ain't it ain't gonna be me no more from nine to five. But we will see, cause I don't know. I still I like I I, I still I kind of miss it because it's, it's something new. Yeah, I've, I've been I made I took the decision and did it like three weeks ago, two weeks ago. So it's, it's brand new. But I do miss the routine of like, I like that. I like having um, a reason like you stand up in the morning and you know, you, you do this and that and that or whatever. And you're going out of the home, which I don't have to now anymore. And that's, a, it's, a, it's it would take me some time to adjust to that because I don't want to fall into like laziness of like sleeping in till 10 a.m. or something. I don't want that. So I have to to see and like really really stay with it you know like stay put and let things seriously happen for me but i kind of really miss that because i feel like that gave me like it, it kept me awake you know it kept me on my feet of like you gotta you gotta go you have to work from this time to this time when you finish then you're already out you can do more like you're more motivated to do things although <laughs> i am an introvert and kind of like anti-social I don't know if I should say that because I feel like I I'm friendly, but I don't know if being friendly um, doesn't go pair to pair with being anti-social. I don't know, but I just feel like I am I am so much more happier, so much more when I'm by myself and not surrounded by people because I can't deal. So anyway, <laughs> that was another point. Yeah, for now, this is really the update that I'm willing to share with you guys. I I have a bigger thing that happened in my life, which is also why I move and all of those things, but I never share that 
part of my life on, on social or I, I never shared it on, on YouTube and I, I don't feel like I'm gonna start now, honestly. Maybe I will change my mind one day, maybe it will be necessary for you to understand certain things, I don't know, but as for now, it's not a, it's not a thing, so, so that's it. Yeah, <laughs> so if you're new, welcome. Welcome, it's really fun over here. <laughs> So stay and I'm very thankful for those who've been following me for I don't know how many years I've been doing this now. I, I, I tried to do this now I think a year and a half or two. Thank you for not unsubscribing. It's just life literally I have, I've always say this but life really happened in between takes. So yeah. I want this now to be a more fun thing, a bit more serious, better quality. Yeah, please if you have any advices, help a girl out, please. Okay, so yeah, I'll see you in the next one.